Hey guys, this is Comic Uno, and today I'm doing a Heroes and Fan Fest, or Heroes and Villains Fan Fest, uh, New York, New Jersey Hall. Uh, sorry guys, I still have laryngitis, I still have my voice that's out. Hopefully, after I heal it from this weekend, um, it will be back for next week when I do my videos. I uh, just need to kind of rest it for a while, but I want to show you this haul. You know, I didn't really do much for this channel because I covered the event for D DC TV Podcast, but I want to do something special for Comic Uno also. Uh, so let's get started and show the haul. So I got a lot of cool stuff because usually at cons that's where I get like my shirts or you know things I wouldn't averagely get in a comic book store which is usually just my comics. So uh, just to show you what I got, um, here are a couple of shirts I got. This is of course I love getting some Arrow shirts. So I got Arrow, the Emerald Archer shirt, so that looked cool. Um, another cool sh uh, shirt which is actually um, Mike Cho's art which I really like his art. Um, I have a Miss Marvel version of this too. I got Hawkeye, and then you have Kate on the bottom there. Definitely will be seeing me wear that shirt somewhere. Uh, also, I have the Astonishing Ant Man because I really like that series, as you know. So those are three shirts. Um, two more shirts I got was and someone fell, but <laughs> uh, was the actual Heroes Villains Fan Fest shirt. And last but not least is the Knocking Point t-shirt from Stephen Amell's wine um, company. So I uh, wanted to support that. Alright, going on. Also a Knocking Point thing I got. Nice mug, which you heard just fall. That's Knocking Point. Got that. Alright, going into the Funkos. This, got, uh, this was just for a really cheap price, so I ended up getting this. Because I, I want to get all the Arrow... Funkos um, in time. I have uh, Oliver Queen I know I have in Black Canary. So, uh, I in another one, which I'll show you. Uh, so I got Felicity Smoke because I, I didn't have that one. So I do have a couple I still need to get. Um, I saw John Diggle for like $85. I, uh, the John Diggle from Legends Tomorrow. That wasn't quite wor worth it for me. Uh, but yeah, this is a definitely cheaper price. Usually Funkos go for like $12. I got, I got that one for $10. Um, I want to go with the, the little mini mites I got. Uh, they, they were really cute. And they have more on their website. So I got to see what they got. But um, they have Supergirl. That was cool. Uh, let's see what else. Batgirl. So you guys know I'm a huge Barbara Gordon fan. <clears throat> have Artemis. So that was really cool. They had a lot of Young Justice ones, uh, but I decided just to get Artemis for this time. I got, and this is the reason why I got the Lego things in the first place, and that was Kitty Pride, of course. As you guys know, I'm a huge Kitty fan. That's the back. Alright, I got two more. One, I gotta thank my friend Mimi for getting this one for me. Uh, started the craze to get the Spider Gwen. Uh, Lego, and last but not least, I like this older costume for Tim, so I got the Red Robin, um, Tim Drake Lego. And then even as like a little cape. So uh, I thought they were cute and something like small to kind of decorate. Uh, so let's get into um, some of the bigger stuff. Um, I did get some prints and like some artist prints, which are cool, but um, I also um, went to two signings, um, <clears throat> which is a big part of this whole entire convention. Um, now one signing I just kind of, uh, didn't want to say randomly got, but like, uh, wasn't planning on getting when I went there, uh, but there's another signing I was planning on getting when I got there. Um, this is the one that I, I got and I wasn't planning on getting, and that was HRG, uh, and that's Jack Coleman. I'm a huge Heroes fan, as you guys might know, so that was amazing. Uh, and, of course... Willa Holland. Yes, finally got to meet Thea. If you guys don't know, I am a huge Willa Holland fan, um, huge Thea Queen fan. Uh, so, yeah, very excited about that. Uh, so I did, I did get that autograph. Um, also, I did get another autograph from Willa, because finally, 
this Funko came out. I will get the Sword one version too. So I got the Thea Funko at the con because I think it came out a little early at the convention. I guess for signing purposes. Uh, and then signed by Willa. So cool. I, I just love that. It is so, so awesome. Alright, so now I'm going to show you the prints I got. Um, which is like some of the artist stuff and one of them fell out. Awesome. Uh, actually, I think this is just a regular picture. Yeah, I got a just a regular picture of Thea too. Maybe I'll like hang it up somewhere. So I don't know where. So I just I got a regular picture just for hanging up purposes. Uh, but I think I might have some more awesome stuff. Uh, I could show you this. This is actually not mine. I'm gonna be giving it to someone else. But I got Jeremy, Mr. J's comics, uh, comic reviews. This Willa Allen Thea print. Thought he really liked that. So. I got that for him. I'll be mailing that out very soon. Uh, something I got for myself, which is kind of, oh, it was actually a free thing because I got a gift for my friend, uh, another friend. So this came free, so I got it. Um, and that was the Oliver Queen print, and this is from Odyssey Art, uh, Brian C. Uh, Roll, which he does some awesome artwork and has a big social media presence. Uh, now here are some cool ones from him too, which this is probably the one I'm going to hang up in some shape or form and that is the Thea Queen little print here I don't maybe I, maybe I don't know I don't know yet uh, but yeah this is something I'm definitely hanging up I, I love it and it was actually only a hundred made so uh, and there's another one where there's only a hundred made and that was the Supergirl Cara Donver, uh, Cara, Cara Donvers Danvers Cara Danvers Great, uh, good talk today. Uh, Cara Danvers, uh, print. I uh, love that it actually is her secret identity and also her, um, her costume. It's just beautiful artwork, so I got that. Um, <clears throat> alright, and last but not least, uh, I also got another Thea, uh, poster, which I probably won't hang up here. I'll probably hang up, like, in my room somewhere. Uh, so I got that, and then a big poster, which I'm hoping I can hang up in my background, and that is all the heroes from Arrow. Uh, so Thea's on the bottom there. We have um, Felicity, Arsenal, Diggle, uh, Sarah, Laurel, Adam, and Oliver Queens. I thought that was really cool. Um, yeah, so that's my big haul that I got. Um, I really enjoyed the convention overall. Um, I tweeted the hell out of it on DC TV Podcasts. Uh, and also I did two interviews, which I'm not going to say which the interviews are yet, but on DCTV Podcast, we will have that, and I'll share on my Twitter and Facebook. So be sure to check it out. Uh, this is Comic Uno, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.